1861, or The Horn, 1966, by Siegfried Gerhard Reinhardt. Siegfried Reinhardt painted puzzles, and like his fellow St. Louis expatriate from Germany, Max Beckmann, declined ever to say what his iconography-rich paintings meant. During his career in St. Louis, Reinhardt painted both secular and religious themes. Looking carefully at this painting, what themes do you see? The title 1861, or The Horn, suggests two themes at once. The musical instrument dominates the composition. Is the horn a call to action? 1861 does evoke the beginning of the Civil War in America. 1966, the year this painting was created, was also a time of great strife in America and the world. It was similar to the anguish and apocalyptic events of the Civil War. In 1966, America witnessed the beginning of the Cultural Revolution of Mao Zedong in China. Charles de Gaulle in France began a tirade of anti-American rhetoric and pulled France out of NATO. Racial unrest was everywhere in America. The Black Panther Party was founded in California, and the Supreme Court established the Miranda rights protecting an individual's rights to avoid self-incrimination through the Fifth Amendment. Reinhardt did say that humanity was his primary interest. He characterized humanity as the eternal lonely crowd, a torrent of faces and figures that gush out of strange architectural settings that are unrelated to any recognizable place in the world. Do you see this in the painting as a positive or negative view of humanity? 